Walker, thank you. And the family of a James Island woman who was found unresponsive in the street is looking to the community to help figure out what happened to her. Jen Drummond's family says there's now a $10,000 reward for information leading to an arrest. News 2's Jordan Sayopa tells us the latest on this investigation and her condition. It's been just over two weeks since Jen Drummond was found severely injured in the street right by her home. She's recovering in the hospital but has a long road ahead. And her friends and family are not giving up in their search for answers. Day 15 and still no answers as to what happened to Jen Drummond on the morning of June 21st. The fact that somebody left Jen in the street is not right. The Charleston County Sheriff's Office says Drummond was found on Woodland Shores Road at 5.40 a.m. with traumatic injuries. She's now recovering in the hospital. <laughs> the Drummond family says last week, Jen emerged from a coma and was reunited with her dog, Danielle. While she cannot speak and has a long road ahead, her family says they're very pleased with her improvements. She's mouthed a few words recently, like her friend Audrey's name. To hear her say my name and know that she remembered me and I hope that given our relationship and our, you know, our, our long friendship, I hope that I'm bringing her peace in such a scary time. Family and friends are asking the person who may be responsible for Drummond's injuries to come forward. Last week, the Charleston County Sheriff's Office released photos of three vehicles driving on Woodland Shores Road between 509 and 518 that morning. And I'm asking those three drivers to come forward, call the sheriff's office, and just tell them, I came through the roadway and there was nothing in the road. This is, has to be a process of elimination. Drummond's support system is not stopping until they find out what happened. Somebody knows something, please contact the sheriff's office. The family is also asking any body shops who may have recently repaired cars with unusual damage to contact the Charleston County Sheriff's Office. Reporting on James Island, I'm Jordan Sayopa, Count on Two. The Charleston County Sheriff's Office about the case, call 843-202-1700. That number is on your screen or Crime Stoppers at 843-554-1111. That's also on your screen right now.